mention this because uh, we have uh, this kind of old buildings and they are really beautiful and uh, they have this um, academic atmosphere. Exactly. For now, I'm seeing the whole browser. Right? Okay. Yeah, thank you. I think now it's better, right? Yes. Oh, great, great. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. You saved me. <laughs> okay, a little bit of geography. Uh, we, where we are located, uh, as I mentioned, in Romania, Europe, part of uh, EU. Uh, it's very, this information is very important for, uh, for uh, the students, for the international students, uh, as they say, uh, we, got, we get uh, EU passport. If we go to Romania, that's true because we are part of the EU. So uh, they, uh, if they will uh, study at our university, they will study in a EU uh, country. Um, our university is located in Cluj-Napoca. That's the name of the city in the heart of uh, Transylvania. Uh, it's uh, the second largest. Uh, city in, uh, in uh, Romania, which international airport, so uh, it's very um, easy for students to, to get to Cluj-Napoca. Uh, they, from most of the uh, uh, big cities, they have uh, direct uh, connections from, example, uh, from Istanbul, uh, they can uh, fly directly to Cluj-Napoca. few pictures uh, of our uh, city. As I mentioned, uh, is uh, the second the largest the city, but it's a uh, small. And I I'm from Cluj, <laughs> and uh, I can say that uh, it's uh, big enough to have uh, all kind of events. Never get bored, but it's small enough to be uh, very safe and very uh, friendly. Let's say. Um, oh, again, our our main building and in the back you can see uh, similar buildings, churches and uh, beautiful landscape in the um, quite close to, to mountains as well. Our students, um, the city has around 400 um, population, but together with college students it gets to five, uh, 500,000 um, inhabitants, because uh, multicultural city, uh, as I said, it's it's due to not only due to our university and our students. Um, uh, it's it's also uh, because uh, we have uh, six public universities in the city and uh, other private universities as well. So you can see the. the the difference, uh, for example, in summertime it's uh, quite uh, quiet, and uh, from October to June it's very, very uh, vibrant with a lot of uh, young people, a lot of events, uh, and um, and uh, all kind of um, social life. It's very important to mention about uh, career opportunities. We have uh, many. Um, international business uh, in our city, many um, um, offices, uh, big buildings with a uh, uh, lot of uh, jobs for, for international uh, people as well. And uh, it's, it's, a, it's a very good place to start your career as well or to study and work as uh, as the, the study visa allows students to work in a part-time job. But this should be, um, should be uh, seen as a, as a second occupation. So their main, uh, uh, their main um, occupation should be the studies. Okay, our university is uh, the oldest uh, university in Romania, which was from uh, uh, 1581. Uh, it's, uh, we have very, very good rankings on, uh, uh, on uh, different, uh, different research, on different uh, 
um, platforms and uh, uh, the, it's very important with, with our students as well many times that if uh, our degrees are recognized internationally, yes, yes, they are fully recognized and uh, they can uh, they can also join courses in other universities. I will uh, tell you a little bit later about the mobilities. Um, we have students from all over the world, as you can see on, on our map. Um, from all continents, uh, mainly from Asia and uh, Africa. From uh, Asia, this year, most of the students were from uh, Bangladesh, uh, from uh, India, um, Turkey, and uh, uh, most uh, Africa, from Africa, uh, most of the students were from Nigeria, Guinea, Morocco, Cameroon, this world. But we we pretty have we pretty cover uh, all countries and all the regions of, of the world. Uh, some numbers uh, about uh, our university and um, the the team of uh, of the university, the community of uh, UBB. Um, we have uh, more than. Uh, 30,000 undergraduate students, more than 8,000 master students, more than 2,000 PhD students, and more than approximately 2,800 teachers. What do we offer? We offer uh, programs in Romanian, in Hungarian, in English, German, and French. Uh, of course, most of the specializations, most of the programs uh, on both undergraduate and uh, master level are in Romanian. Uh, but we have uh, uh, quite many programs, mostly in English. Bachelor uh, level, uh, at, at bachelor level, uh, the candidates can choose from mathematics, computer science, physics, chemistry, engineering, um, economics, uh, political science, international relations, uh, business administration, and uh, a few others. Uh, at master level, uh, we have uh, one, more 160 programs in Romania, and we have quite many in English, 39 this year. Uh, of course, we have in Hungarian, German, Italian, and French as well. The uh, specializations, the fields are pretty much uh, the same. Uh, they are in the same field, but uh, uh, more specific on, on, a, on a, a specific specialization or a specific domain. About the Romanian language repertory year, as I told you before, uh, most of the programs are in Romanian, uh, but for those who uh, plan to, to uh, study in Romanian, we offer the Romanian preparatory year. It's a one-year uh, study program. It uh, follows the structure of an academic year. In academic, the academic year in Romania is from October to June. Um, we have two semesters. And uh, the students uh, at Romanian preparatory year would have 25 hours per week of Romanian language. In the first semester, they have general uh, language uh, vocabulary, but in the second semester, they will uh, split into different uh, groups of different domain as they chose before. So if somebody uh, wants to uh, uh, to study doctoral studies for medicine, then uh, he will or she will study uh, different vocabulary from those who will plan to continue with economics or mathematics or letters, philosophy or something like that. Uh, I will mention also about uh, our international uh, summer course of Romanian language and civilization is for those who would like to uh, learn more about uh, 
uh, our culture and to uh, improve their Romanian language uh, skills because it's a very, very intense, uh, intensive um, a course of three weeks, but it will also uh, get um, some social life, some social events, so it's, it's very, very uh, dynamic and very interesting. It's, uh, it's during summer. This, this is an old uh, uh, one, I, but it's, it's also on July, August, so if you are interested, just you can send us an email and we'll uh, send you the new updated uh, um, structure for, the, for this year. Uh, uh, studying abroad opportunities for international students and EU students. Uh, about the EU students, I will tell you just a few, um, a few th important things. Uh, if you, if there are agencies who also recruit students from EU countries, because the procedure is totally different. Uh, EU students, EU candidates will follow exactly the same uh, uh, admission procedure as our students, Romanian students, and uh, they will have, uh, they uh, are, um, they have the same right, the same uh, tuition fee, uh, the same uh, procedure as Romanian students, and the uh, admission is in July, and we have another admission for the um, places that were not occupied in July in September. Uh, so there are two admissions in July and September. Uh, if uh, if we, you have, uh, if you will be interested, then you can send us an email and, uh, or you can check on our website. Uh, but I will focus now uh, with my presentation to, to international students. Um, they uh, have the possibility to study abroad with uh, Erasmus. It, through a mobility that can be Erasmus, CIPUS, uh, for, um, for German speaking, uh, the BAB, uh, the Mokovets program for Hungarian uh, in Hungary, and the Fulbright program in, uh, in the United States. But the most common and uh, the most popular is the Erasmus. About accommodation, um, this is also very important. I think it's the second most important thing. If we provide uh, accommodation in the campus, uh, yes, we provide accommodation in the campus. Uh, we have uh, 17 dormitories. It's uh, true that it's not only for international students, it's also for the Romanian students, or exchange students, or uh, other type of students, uh, scholarship students, so we have uh, as you saw from the numbers, we have quite uh, uh, many students, so we need uh, uh, dormitories. Um, they are all modern buildings um, uh, with uh, uh, good facilities. Uh, we don't have single rooms, but we have double rooms with three or five uh, students uh, in a room. 